Okay. Hello. Peace. So, I'm not doing my intro right now, and I'm filming on my iPod. Because it's like 9 at night, I don't feel like filming the video. And then uploading it takes like half an hour. And then all that kind of stuff, so it's not going to have my intro. And it's going to be the like bad quality one, but at least I'll have better sound this time. So, this is just going to be a haul video. Most of it from today, but then a few things from a little while ago that are mostly just... Kind of, yeah. Okay, so I'm going to get started right away because I don't want to be talking forever and ever. So, today, like at PetSmart, I got this nature ball with the bell. And they've had the smaller versions before and they really like them. But they chew them up so fast. So I got the bigger version for guinea pigs and rabbits, but it's the same thing, just bigger. And so, this... I don't have the receipt for PetSmart with me because it is downstairs in my wallet. But this was $3.99, I'm pretty sure. And, yeah. And I got another one of these Living World Treehouse things, which I love. And I've mentioned in other videos about Henry's getting old. And this was going to be for Snoopy and Pillow because they don't currently have a like a house. Because they chewed theirs up. But then I looked down, like, oh, I hope they can fit under it. And so I'm going to try it, but if not, I have another one that I bought. And I also bought another one a few days ago that's in there right now, behind her nest. I'm not going to take it out, because her nest is built around it. Thing. Yes, and this was $4.99, I believe. And last thing I got at PetSmart were some more of these Fiesta Healthy Toppings, the dried papaya things. Looks like Snoopy. And all of my gerbils love these, and they're $2.99. And they're, like, pretty healthy, and there's a lot in a pack, and they're just really good, and I love them. I don't normally buy from KT, but I do like these. But I don't buy their hay or their food or anything. I don't think they make gerbil food. I don't know. But I don't buy their food, just like this. I try to not buy from them because I heard that they use preservatives, which I don't like, but... Those treats are amazing. And I'll move on to what I got at Walmart. The first thing I got at Walmart were these Timothy Chews. Because I had a gift card. So I figured why not spend even more money on my pets than I already do. Because I spoil my pets. So they're just regular Timothy hay packed into cubes in the living world. And blah on the back. Freshness guaranteed. And these were, in a second, oh, they were five ninety seven. So, they're, like, really good, I think, and healthy, and gerbils, I bet we'll love them. And I also got these at Walmart. They're Nibble Sticks by Hearts. And I haven't had these before with these gerbils. But my other gerbils, oh, reflection, okay. And my other gerbils did love them. And they were cheap. They were only one twenty-seven for nine of these uh, rainbow sticky things. So I got those. And at Walmart, I also got this coconut cabana. We got a cute hamster. And I'll just pull it out. And this is the other hat I got, Snoopy and Pluto. And I'm not sure if they'll both fit in this either, but it's, like, cute. And I think they might, like, rolling it around and chewing it because it's all natural. It's pretty awesome. I just hope Snoopy doesn't try to go through those two. Just that one because he's so fat. Well, he's not fat. He's just big, as I call him. He's not really, like, pudgy or anything. But the other day, he got stuck in that cheese block right there. He started to go through and then his hips got stuck. And I had to wiggle him out and I felt really bad because I was afraid he was getting hurt. But what can you do if your gerbil is stuck in a cheese block? So yeah, I got that. And then a few days ago, I got Henry the new water bottle because the other one was getting chewed up over here. And this one's the bigger kind and I need to refill it because she drank a lot. And I switched them to the Oxbow Gerlin Hamster Food. 
which isn't my favorite because it's pretty dull and boring. And my gerbils don't really select feed, so it's not really a problem with me. Actually, I'm not sure because maybe they do a bit, but they tend to eat most of their food, so I'm not too concerned about it. But my pet store ran out of their regular food, and they haven't brought it back in yet, and I'm not sure if they're going to, so I just switched them to this for now. Switch them to, yeah, switch them to this for now. And it's also cheaper, so that's good too. And they seem to be enjoying it. Oh, 5.33, better hurry this up. It's okay, only have two things left. Oh, and that was like $8.99, just so you know. And the hut was $3.86. Kind of forgot about that. And then these cat toy looking things are these croc banana treats and they like them and they're like $1.99 and they have fruit vitamins and omega-3 so I don't give them to them too often because they're pretty big I usually split them in half but they do like them and then I got these yogurt drops which I'm sure you've all seen them before these ones have added, added vitamin C yeah living world these are yogurt flavored you know, like $2.99 or something so I'm sure everyone has heard of those before so I spent probably on all this total of like $35 so it's a pretty decent amount and I'm excited to try like the hut out and see how this one's for Henria by the way because she is in love with them and she hasn't gotten a new toy recently I mean those two just what day is get them oh hello cutie I got oh yeah I got them like this nut thing that they kind of chewed up. It was like this little toy with a nut dangly thing. But, so Henry's going to be getting that and then they might get that and blah blah blah. And, just quickly videos in the future. I'm doing a riding montage thing. I'm a jig, but I'm getting some more clips. And I'm going to the f my first show next weekend. So I'll ask someone to film that. If I end up riding, because the pony that I ride is a little bit crazy. And she, like, kind of goes crazy and refuses jumps. So we're going to see how she's feeling. And if she's good, then I'll ride her in the show. If not, I'll just make clips of, like, other things. Well, not other things, like other what riding. And, yeah. And, yeah. I guess that's all for today. Sorry for the lack of videos lately. I mean, it hasn't been that bad, like, two weeks, week and a half or something. I did have one filmed, but I didn't upload it because I didn't really like it. And almost eight minutes now, and if anyone has watched this far, you are amazing and awesome. And, yeah. Okay. I'm going to end the video, like, right now. So, thank you so much for watching. Bye.